Yeah, this is an area where you can get to a loopable portal, I believe. Yes. Yep. Wait, what? What's going on, warriors? Welcome to another episode of The Messenger. And guys... My volume's a little too high. Guys, <clears throat> seriously, this freaking soundtrack is so amazing. And I also... Last episode, I was trying to do the Underwater Labyrinth, and I found out... Uh, what you have to do is you actually have to go to the Quillshoom Marsh and find a, a different item that helps you with it by notifying you if you're going the right way. Um, so, <clears throat> yeah, um, I, I definitely needed to find that out because otherwise the, the thing was basically too hard. Also, with the Forlorn Temple level, oh jeez, with the Forlorn Temple level, the way that you actually access it is... Now, I didn't actually look this up, but I realized that I, like, when I saw somebody going into it, uh, in a picture, actually, um, oh, well, that could have killed, no, 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 that wouldn't kill me, but I saw somebody going into it in a picture, and in that picture, um, in that picture, they actually, uh, what's it called, there was a bridge, and I realized that all these phobicans are working on a bridge. You gotta find the last phobican. That's all you have to do. So, because of that, I, I'm pretty sure I know how to do the thing. Um, okay, let's see. The soundtrack, man. I've been, I've been listening to it. They have it on Spotify, by the way, but guys, listen, if you do not have Spotify, but you know what? Screw it. Even if you do have Spotify, go on Steam, and when you buy this game, also buy the soundtrack, okay? Because this game, this game has an amazing soundtrack. It's just such a fantastic soundtrack, and you, you, you will definitely not regret it. I mean, basically all of the tracks are tracks that I enjoy listening to. And by the way, the portal is down there, and that's why you can't access that. You can only access the portal in the future, I guess. Alright, so we just have to go through, and we're gonna access this, this last power seal. Alright, we're gonna try and find all the power seals. I mean, they, they keep saying, or they don't keep saying, but the guy said originally that it was an overpowered upgrade, and... I, I like overpowered upgrades, so, you know, you tell me I'm gonna get an overpowered upgrade, I'm gonna try to go for it, you know what I mean? Okay, um... Okay, now I actually have to be in the future for this part, because I have to go this way, and they will not let you access this area in the, in the uh, the past. Okay. Okay. Okay, that is the portal that I needed to be in. There we go. Oh. Okay, well, the skeletons respawn, which it makes total sense why they would, because the monsters always respawn. Should I save? I'm gonna save. Alright. Well, this doesn't look too... Well, actually, hold on a second. Um... Wait a second. Ah. Okay, well, that... That was not meant to happen at all. I was trying to jump down, but... Okay. Um, what if you could, like, use this thing? I don't think you can. I, I don't think you can use the air current to go down. Okay, now wait. So, so you're just supposed to... Hang on a second. So what are you supposed to do here? You're supposed to... Get through that entire area? Yeah, there's no place for you to rest. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh man, I was close. 
I was close. I think if I had gone just a tiny bit before, then I then I would have done it. All right, I think I can do this. Oh no! <laughs> Well, that's tough. I think I might need to use a rope dart there. All right, just use the rope dart. Okay. Boom. Oh, that was bad. Ah, dang it, man. Do 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 do. <laughs> okay. No, no. There we go. Oh, man. Oh, again, rope dart. I should have used the rope dart, but I did not. And there's absolute. There's just no place to rest. It's like... There's there's literally no place that you can, that you can rest. You can't rest down there. I don't think you can. There, and there's no space over here. Like, it just totally crushes you. I guess we could try. We, we could try going down to the very bottom and just crouching. Oh, well that changes the game. Well, that's not so bad, actually. All right, well, we got the power seal. And I believe that's the last power seal in this area. We just got to get through the underwater labyrinth. But again, you know, that's, um, that's something we have to get another uh, item for. So we are actually going to go to the Quillstrom Marsh. We have to find out how to go there? That, that way, I guess. Is that, but is that the Quillstrom Marsh? Yes, it is. And you can see that, by the way, with the Howling Grotto thing down at the bottom, you can see the Underwater Labyrinth. Alright, and there are also three Power Seals to get at the Quillstrom Marsh, so... Yeah. We just got to go up, and then to the right, and they... Okay, we got this. There is, like, a secret entrance. You know what? Actually, we're gonna go to the secret entrance of the Quillshroom Marsh. We're actually gonna go there. I, th I believe you're only able to access that entrance in the future. Which is good. It means there, there might be something that was previously inaccessible, like a power seal that was previously inaccessible, that we can now access because we're in the future. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, but there is a time, a power, or a time shard, a big time shard. Uh, oh. Actually, I think we have to be in the past for this to go through here. Because I don't think we can go down there. Yeah, down there is death. So, dang it, man. Ah. Oh no, I'm down to one hit point. Stop. Oh my gosh. I still have not gained any more hit points. Did we just get to it? Okay, good, a checkpoint. Whew. All right, that's fine. Aha, I got him. Oh, what? It respawned. Dang it, man. Oh, don't don't make him respawn again. Whoa, whoa, what? I, I sent the shuriken flying at him. He ducked. Okay, I need to be in the past, so I do need to go back through. Oh, man. Jeez. Oh, after I fully restored my hit points. Alright, let's we'll save again. And then, we go back through this area, which is actually basically the same as in the future. Alright, we're all good. Wait a second. That, that looks like you can break that. I guess I'm wrong. Lost two hit points for no reason. All right. Let 
we just go down here, and then we can go through, yeah, there. Good. So we can only actually access that area in the past. We can only actually go through there in the past. Oh, yeah, I forgot the, the green demons require three hits. All right, you go all the way up. Boom. Hey, and now we could go in the shop. But we don't need to. We're gonna. We're just gonna go to the secret entrance, and we gotta go. We actually have to go into the future right here because again, I th I'm pretty sure this area is only accessible in the future. Oh come on! Stop! Okay. Okay, we got that. Uh oh. Uh, okay. That's fine. Just gotta go this way. Why, well, I use shurikens a lot more now. Like, in the beginning of the game, I didn't really use them very often, but now I use them a lot. And it's just because I... Now I can find good uses for them. To make my life easier. Okay, so this is the secret entrance right here. You just have to swim like this, you can boost... So this is the Quillshroom Marsh, and today, by the way, is the day that the second episode of The Messenger premiered. Yeah, I bet you that this is the one of the power seals here. You go up, well maybe, let's see, you can actually go this way? Oh, I have no idea where this is going to take me, hold on. I want to go up here. I want to see where this takes me, first of all. I've already been to this area. Okay. But I have not been here. Oh, this is a completely new area. Um... Well... Uh... Okay. Interesting. And that's a way to get to the Searing Crogs. Okay, so that's actually an entrance to another zone. Which we do not need to go for. And there's not really anything special to get over here? I was trying to get that guy. I ended up getting a hit point for that. I don't think I needed it, but... Besides, they just respawn like that. And I just wasted another one. Okay, so... So we know that we need to go up. Alright, and then we need to find... I've heard that you can get that secret item by falling through quicksand, but... But, I... You need to actually be careful about where you do that, because... Pretty much every single area would result in death, so I'm assuming that we can... I didn't look up where it was. I didn't want to spoil too much of this game. So... Oh, there is a portal right there, and it's a loopable portal, and I bet you we have to be in the future in order to access that power seal. I bet you. I'm gonna go there, just just to make sure. If, if there's some way that we can actually access that area without, um, without going into the future, without doing that really difficult portal, then perhaps we will try that. But... Yeah... Wait, if I save here? Can I just fall through the quicksand here? No, you just die. <laughs> you just die. Okay, so... You've gotta be in the future. In other words, you've got to go through that really difficult, uh, looping portal. But hopefully it becomes easier once you actually go through the portal. I'm hoping. No, stop! No! Oh no! It's so hard! Okay, good. I restored all my hit points. Okay, so this is... Where you do that. Oh, 
Oh no. Okay, well that was not as difficult as it was last time. <laughs> Alright. But I'm definitely going to a secret area now because I, I'm, I'm, I've never been in the Quillshroom Marsh in the future. So, I've only been there in the past. So seeing it 500 years later... Oh yeah, look at that! There's no quicksand there anymore. Okay. So this is definitely a power seal. Whoa. Why is my nose clogged? <laughs> okay, well this doesn't look too hard actually. Oh, jeez. Well, there is quicksand. Just not the entire zone anymore. Okay, so this just looks like they just switch places. Okay, actually this is not too bad, because you could just jump on the quicksand. I don't understand what the deal is with this. Why is this why would this be difficult? Alright, but we did that, but is there like some secret area beyond this? No, it doesn't appear so. But there is an area below there. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna continue going back here. And we're actually going to. Whoa! Okay. Well, we died. Okay, we need to just go... We need to be careful about this this time. Just jump all the way to the end of this zone right here. Oh, and I restored my hit points. Well, that's all. Again, always welcome. Okay, so... There's another power seal off this direction, and also I got hit. I don't want to get hit. Oh, well, <laughs> fully restoring my hit points. Okay. Just go up. Ah, geez. And of course, guys, do you remember when I was first going through these things? And I, and I was like, why do they put one on each side? Are they anticipating, is there some part of the game where you have to go back through these? Or they're just giving you the option. That's why. That's why they put one on each side. Because you will, at some point, be going through this in another time period, and you'll be going in a different direction. And you've got to be able to navigate these levels both ways. And it's really, really smart the way they did that. Also, that bird just totally screwed off. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Okay. Tested. Maybe I could fully restore my hit points there. Okay. Wow. I'm dead. I have died. Falls fails, you could try jumping. Yeah, no crap. Alright, I'm back here now. I think I was close to a save point. Alright, let's see if we can make it without losing any hit points this time. All right, not too bad. Oh, okay, we still do need to get through this part with this guy. Yes, he's got him. Gosh, I love using my shurikens like this. All right, just need to make it through here, which is not a problem. And then I am quite close. Yeah, I'm actually quite close. To, uh, okay, hold on. I'm actually quite close to a save point. Okay, I'm actually... I'm really close to a save point. I just need to not get crushed here. Oh, I didn't know it went through those. Okay, let's go... Oh, okay. A little nervous about that, but I did make it to the save point. And now that power seal just over here, we just gotta find a way to go up. And I'm pretty sure you have to be in the future because I probably would have seen it if it were in the past. Okay. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, man, I tried to get that guy. 
so many of these guys. Jeez. Okay. Now, okay, we're still not there yet. And there is, I think there's another save point at the end of this zone, so we can also just, like, go there and then save. Just because you know that the power seal is going to involve danger that might possibly kill you, so good to get a save point. Whoa! Wait, the grappling- or sorry, not the grappling hook, the rope dart. The rope dart attack... Oh no! The rope dart attack... Yeah, this is how you get up. The rope dart attack actually also does triple damage. Well, that sucked. Oh no, stop moving, or not- well no, don't- just- just get back here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, this is insane. Okay. Oh my goodness, that scared the frick out of me. And I only have one hit point left. Luckily, that, that stage did not involve something that instantly killed you, or else that would have been way too difficult. Alright, but I did make it through there, and there is another way, actually, to go below the save... I'm dead. There is actually a way to go below the save point, but I didn't see that. Yeah, now I see it. What? You have to go from the other direction. Oh, yeah, there must be some... This is like a secret passage. I bet you this is the secret area. Yeah, because I can see another lower entrance there. Oh, is there a portal there? Is that a portal? Yes, there is. So I can go to the past if I need to. All right. I also bet that secret entrance to the Searing Crags, I bet you that that is where you can find the Phobokin. And also, this is a uh, this is a, the, the entrance to the secret area. I don't know if it's the same place. Oh my gosh, what? Yeah, that was not gonna happen without getting hit. But where are we going now? What? I have no idea what's going on. I don't even know where I am or why I'm here. Uh... Okay, that was kind of close, actually. Okay, but there is a save point, thank goodness, but, but why? There's nothing here. You just, it's just a way to skip part of the level. I don't want to do that. <laughs> that doesn't matter to me. Why do I need to do that? I mean, I can go through here. It's just a one-way door. But, okay, save again just to restore some of my hit points. But I'm going to go down that other area and see if, if see if that's a secret area. Okay, we gotta go up, not down. We gotta go up and then left. Whoa, whoa, whoa! There is a thing that will fully restore my hit points, but I'm not going for it. Whoa! All right, that's just a time shard, though. And there's no way to go down from here, so like that. This is the zone. That's it. Does this at least fully restore my? Thank you. At least it gives me something for my time. But, I mean, I don't even need... I don't really even need the time shards too much anymore. Like... So that's the only area that I could find over there. Are there any other secret areas like that? I mean, there's a secret... Wow, what? I have no idea where the secret area would be. All I can see is that there's another power seal right there, but I don't see any place where you can, like, fall down quicksand. What I read online could have been wrong, or I could be in the wrong time period. I don't I don't know if I actually finished this thought, but like I think the secret entrance to the Searing Crags, that might actually uh they may that may actually be 
um, where you could um, get the last Phobican and like get the like Pyro because you know you gotta get Pyrophobic Pyrophobican represents fear of fire and it makes total sense actually. Um, I think we just have to keep going forward. Just go forward. Maybe it's, um, maybe that area is, like, after you get the power seal? Whoa. Scared the frick out of me. Whoa. Okay. There we go. Okay. You got this. Oh, jeez. There's, like, a lot of these guys that run in this area. It's hard to avoid those, those projectiles. Oh, jeez. Okay, we just gotta jump over that. This gameplay is... It's just... It's just really awesome. Like, I... I'm definitely giving this game a 10 out of 10. Like, it, already it's earned it. Even though I haven't actually finished the game yet. Even if the ending is kind of like crappy. Like, I, I could even deal with a crappy ending, because this game is just really fun. And even, even if the ending is crappy, the gameplay is worth it. Uh, how am I supposed to get through here? Well, if you can sacrifice two hit points, I suppose you can get through it like that. Okay. So, jeez. Oh, no, 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 no. I have a single hit point. Okay, well, I... <laughs> I did get one back, but... I really need another one. I need to fully restore them. Is that one? No, it, it, it does sometimes. Oh, no, I have a single one left again. I'm really bad at this game, aren't I? Oh, I did get one left. Or, one back. Oh, my gosh. That, that I can, like... Okay, thank goodness I fully restored them. Okay, just gotta keep going forward. Oh! Okay, got both of those guys. My thumb is actually hurting from the... Whew. My thumb is actually hurting from the amount of pressing of A and X that I'm doing. Okay, so I've gone down there. I've already gone down there, and I think that's where the power seal was. We just gotta keep going this way. Whoa. Alright, made that. We don't need to go forward or back in time. Obviously, we can't go forward because we're already in the future. Whoa. Oh, you could go in the past. Oh, oh, you can only access this from the future, so. Oh no, stop. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, I could actually use this. Yeah, I could do that. Okay. And we've never been in here in the future before. We've only been here in this particular area in the past, so. Oh. Oh my gosh, jeez. These guys are cruel. Can I just go down here and go in like that? No. Okay, well, I did get one hit point back. Okay, what I've got to do is hit this and then go over here like this. Got it. And I believe you can actually get crushed. You. Whoa. Trying to kill me. Can't kill me, baby. 
Alright, now guys, if you are enjoying this series, I'm gonna go ahead and say this before I end the episode because I'm not I'm I'm not quite ready to end the episode yet, but I, I'm trying to like cut down on my outro time. But if you're enjoying the series, please feel free to leave a like, subscribe, join the Discord server. Also, comment. Like, let me know what you're thinking in the comments, because I love to read your comments. Um, oh, whoa. Whoa, oh man, I want to I wanna hit these guys. Oh, I did. But you've got to like... Oh, what? This is really weird. Okay, hold on. Let me see if I can do this. Well, how do you make it up here, though? Do I have to go in the past? I think I have to go in the past. Oh, what? Whoa. Whoa, how am I... What? Uh, excuse me? Do I have to go like this? Okay, well, I guess that's a, ooh, a little too close for comfort. Can I... Is there a loopable portal here that I can go through? You have to go in the... Yeah, I think you have to approach it from the past. Yeah, I, I think... I think I know what it is. You have to approach it from the past. You use the fireflies to morph you into the future. Uh, to where there are no spikes. But I've got to find a, a loopable portal first. And I, I hope this would be the area where I can get a loopable portal. Okay. Uh-oh. Okay. Now, this is an area... Yeah, this is an area where you can get to a loopable portal, I believe. Yes. Yep. Wait, what? Hey, this is the monk who brought the butterfly matriarch to restore the grove centuries ago. Looks like she's been corrupted. Let me help her out. What? I didn't even do any... I, I forgot about that, actually. I didn't even know you were supposed to do this. I just thought it was kind of like a little bit of story. Like... Okay, so we've uncorrupted the monk. <gasps> huh? What happened? The primal fear, it... Take a deep breath, dear monk. It seems you fell to the curse of quills. What are you doing here? Is the butterfly matriarch all right? All is well, you can relax. How long has it been? And this marsh, what have I done? I need to go see the prophet. She'll be fine. There has never been a stronger messenger. What? What? That was like a burn at me. They're gonna swipe at me. Okay, but now we are in the past, so we can we can approach that area with the um with the uh, what's it called the power seal in the correct way. Why would you, oh yeah, you have to go through this one. Oh my gosh. What? This green demon's so slow. No wonder I call them the turtle demons. Or turtle guys. They're so slow. Ah, okay. Much, much easier to do it in the past. <laughs> much, much easier to get through that area in the past. Okay, so. Um... Okay, this is also pretty easy. So we just have to approach this area. Yes, yes! That's exactly what we have to do. So, except we do have to cloud jump off of that guy. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, we have to cloud jump off of these projectiles. Oh, jeez. No, no, okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. All right. Okay, we're good.
Okay, well this allows us to go over here, and this is actually where the thing is. But... What? Whoa! I made it. Alright, I made it. <laughs> we made it! And then I can climb up here, I suppose. But this is not anything special. This ain't no thing. Restoring all key charges and hit points. So now we've got everything in the Quill Shroom Marsh, but... I don't see any secret areas. Unless there's something secret over there that I have not seen. But I don't think so. I, I don't know, it doesn't look like there is, but... There are no secret entrances to other screens. I suppose we can try. We can try to go over there. But that's going to be the next episode. So, guys, uh, please feel free to become a Patreon supporter if you feel so inclined. Thank you so much to Shem for doing so. And thank you to everyone for watching. And I will see you guys next time.